What? We can't leave. It's like magic. We're in an actual musical. Please, God, no. Oh. Wow. Ooh, what musical? That's a good question. Hmm. That's tough. I was going to say Light in the Piazza strictly because it's 1953 summer Italy. Like, what more could you ask for? And, like, to fall in love and, like, go to all the museums? Call it a day. When I, high school Cinco thought he was Pippin, you know, like, really identified with Pippin. The song Extraordinary was, like, my theme song, you know, and that was the one I would sing alone in my room because I thought I was special and was trying to figure out place in the world, you know? Minus the tuberculosis, I wouldn't mind being in uh, the turn of the 20th century Bohemian Paris. It seems like a very romantic place to be, minus the uh, disease. <laughs> so maybe in the Moulin Rouge. I feel like all the musicals I loved so much are a little bit, I, it would be terrifying to go in, you know, it's like to do into the woods, but then there, I could get squashed. Hair, it was politically a nice, uh, it was a politically a time I embraced. I'm gonna say Avenue Q. I'm not so sure I would do so well, like in Victorian London. <laughs> Lots of scenarios. I'm like, mm, I don't think I want to live there. Don't think I want to, but like Avenue Q. Yeah, I can live with that. We're in a musical, okay? Nobody gets killed in a musical except Oklahoma and Carousel and South Pacific. Oh, hello, West Side Story. That's all the musicals.